if you do want to use an oxide, the oxides are all in these containers, what you're going to do is first stir it up, and then you may need to add some water to it. You want to get all the goop kind of like forced back in to the water. So all those little chunks of oxide need to be mixed in. And then what you're going to do is take your brush and pull it up on the sidewall. And this, you should be able to see through it in five seconds. If not, then you need to add more water. And when you add more water, it should just be tiny amounts. No more than a few drops. And then you're going to test it again. One, two, three, four, five. Nothing happened. You're going to add some more. One, two, three, four, five. Nothing's happened. I'm going to add a lot more because this stuff is feeling rather thick. One, two, three, four, five. A little bit more. I can start to see it breaking a tiny bit. And what you'll see is right there, see where it started to uh, become translucent. So, one, two, three, four, five, nothing. One, two, three, four, five, nothing. It's on six. Okay, we're getting there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. See how it's starting to break? You can see my finger. So I'm going to put a tiny bit more because we want it on five seconds. Hopefully I didn't get too much. One, two, three, four, five. See how you can see my finger now through the back? That's exactly how you want it. Then what you can do is on something that's glazed already, you can paint a pattern onto that thing just by stroking on the piece but only on top of glaze, not on top of raw clay. So I could put it in here, um, but I don't want to put it in there because I don't want that in there. <laughs> and now you know how to use an oxide and how to make it thin enough. And then I'll wash that out, clean this up, put this away. That's where all the other ones are. And that's blue green's the only one that's been worked on, so all these might need some extra water just like I just did. So that's on you guys to do. And if you get it too thin, it's just not going to show up very well. Um, and if you get it too thick, the oxide tends to crack. So just be aware to make it just how I showed you in the video.